Good morning, dear children. Children, we were reading lesson one of our English grammar. That is naming words, and I hope you all remember what are naming words. Naming words are the names given to any person, place, animal, or thing. Today. we would do the last page of this chapter so we are doing page number 4 today question number d and our question says name there are sorry there are two naming words in each sentence underline them in these sentences there are two naming words in each sentence means in every sentence you will get two naming words and you have to identify and underline those naming words let's read our first sentence our first sentence says the birds are on the tree so in this sentence two naming words are birds and tree underline them when we say birds birds will come under the कैटेगरी ऑफ एनिमल्स जब हम ये पढ़ते हैं कि नेमिंग वर्ड्स आर द नेम ऑफ पर्सन प्लेस एनिमल और थिंग वेन वी से एनिमल इट डजेंट मीन ओनली कैट डॉग काउ हॉर्स दीज टाइप्स ऑफ एनिमल्स आर इंक्लूडेड नो इट इंक्लूड्स योर बर्ड्स ऑल्सो स्मॉल इंसेक्ट्स ऑल्सो like a cockroach or a house fly or anything okay so birds we will underline birds and tree tree because it is the name of a thing now our second sentence is a horse eats grass and this we will underline horse and grass why because horse is the name of an animal and grass is a thing a sheep gives us wool we will underline sheep name of animal wool name of thing fourth is the children are in the garden we will underline children name of people and garden name of place then the teacher is writing on the board in this we will underline teacher and board teacher because it is also name of a person and board is the name of a thing so our this question is over now we have question number e which says complete the story by filling in the blanks with the naming words now children you can see blanks are given and against these blanks you have some pictures identify this picture recognize this picture and you have to write the name of that picture in the blank for example once a dash what should come in the dash this is the picture of a lion so once a lion was caught in a this is the picture of a net we will write net here let me write l i o n lion and n e t net okay a dash saw him this is the picture of a mouse we will write mouse the dash said again this is a picture of a mouse right here mouse can i help you kya main tumhari madad kar sakta hu a dash heard this this is a picture of a goat right goat here she laughed the dash said again this is a picture of goat the goat here like this you have to complete the whole story fill the blanks and you'll get a complete story read it and understand it it's a very short story and very nice story so this 
question you will do as your homework okay with this question we finish our chapter 1 of english grammar like we did this question we have similar question in our english course book also this is your english course book and here page number 17 we have this grammar part here also we have the same question you read in the first paragraph they have told us about the naming words the highlighted words tell us the names of people per animal places and things this we have already learned we come straight away come to the question read these sentences and underline the names of people places animals and things so our first sentence is the baby is sleeping in this sentence our naming word is baby then archita likes lilies so here we will underline archita because it is the name of a girl and lilies it is the name of flower the mouse is eating cheese we will underline mouse and cheese my brother is playing badminton we will underline brother and badminton uncle always carries an umbrella with him we will underline uncle and umbrella the earth is a beautiful planet we will underline earth and planet we love reading little red riding hood we will underline the whole word why because it is the name of a book so we will underline little red riding hood the dog likes to run in the park we will underline dog and park the ants are working hard we will underline only ants my sister has gone to the museum sister and museum sujata wants to buy a pencil we will underline sujata and pencil the school will open on monday we will underline school and also we will underline monday so with this we finish all the work all the questions related to naming words that's all for today do your homework neatly and nicely in your books thank you children bye bye